Hello there folks, I'm Dan Brown from a sort of interestinglife.com and you're joining me on my good old mango bike single speed as we hurtle downhill just on the English side of the England and Wales border from the top of the race course, a little bit of common ground on top of a hill outside of my good old hometown of Oswestry and this is an absolutely beautiful evening that we're out on the bike and this is an absolutely beautiful part of the world. This is a two and a half mile route. This is again a completely different route, probably the third or fourth video that I've done just of different roads coming down from the same hilltop. And again, these are all the places that I've grown up traveling up and down and mainly by boots on this road. So you can imagine that doing this on a bike, just from what you're seeing on the screen now, how brilliantly steep and downhill it is. Oh, I absolutely love it. And again, it sort of goes to show just how rural Oswestry, where I've grown up, truly is that in about, I think this video, even though I'm on a single speed bike, so I haven't got loads of really big gears that I can really floor it and pedal really quick, even as I'm hurtling downhill on very steep parts already. So even with that taken into account, I still made about the two and a half mile trip in less than, I think it was six minutes something to the sort of area that I consider the start of the town centre. So you can imagine in the past and on my uh, proper geared bike, just how quickly you can put in those two and a half miles. Absolutely fantastic stuff. So yeah, this is a mixture really of what I absolutely love in life. A good bit of biking, I absolutely love really quick downhill stretches just for the sheer, well, the fact that so much of my life is so slow, I suppose, that when you do get these very fast bits of excitement and these extremely steep parts, you can see there's various points here where I chicken out and, well, I'm not chicken out, I just use a bit of common sense and actually squeeze on the brakes every now and then. But to just have these little bits of excitement and fun and games on the bike thrown in in the middle of such incredible scenery is absolutely fantastic and as I say it's another sign of how incredibly lucky I've been to grow up in areas like this. Perhaps growing up in these sorts of environments for so long really does sum up uh, the root cause of my obsession with being out in places like this now, whether that's on the boats, in me boots or on the bike and so on, maybe even in the kayak these days. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to share this uh, particular route as it's another one of those iconic places that I've walked up and down an awful lot in the past and obviously in more recent times been more into me biking and I really just wanted to share yet another route from the Oswestry Street race course down into Oswestry Street with you all. Uh, at this point, I'd also like to just say a huge thank you to everybody who supported me on Patreon as this is the first post-Patreon announcement a video that I've uploaded and I've got to be honest I really didn't know what to expect and didn't know whether people were going to support me or not on there and the fact that well, to be completely honest I didn't expect anything and I was expecting it to quietly disappear after the first week but the fact that people have actually gone over and supported me and well, I just can't thank you enough and also I can't thank the individual enough for the single biggest and most generous PayPal donation I've ever received so thank you so much for the support because as I said it just it just means so much to me in every sense not only practically but as I say in so many videos and here there and everywhere just the morale boost and confidence boost that it gives me to sit down and make these videos particularly the longer more complex videos and documentaries it's just incredible so thank you so much to everybody for all of the incredible support and thank you just to everybody who tunes in and watches these videos. The fact that you spend time watching them is more than I could have ever asked or hoped for. So, on that note, I'll say, as usual, feel free to check out my other videos for weekly boating and biking videos. Feel free to subscribe or add me personally on Facebook and Twitter and even like the Facebook page for loads of photos and updates from Life Afloat. And of course, until the next time, I'll wrap things up and just say thank you once again. Feel free to check out my books available for the Kindle. Links to everything mentioned in the description below. And until the next time, keep it boat worthy, keep it bike worthy, and of course, farewell.